Hi guys, welcome back to another bowgun build video. Today we will tackle Safijiva's Snipe Cannon. At the current state of the game, it's not really much of an upgrade from our current Pierce 3 HBG, which is the Kadachi, but who knows, if it gets more augment slots, it might be a game changer. As you can see in the ammo table, Pierce 3 is the only useful ammo here. Although it has some status ammos, the recoil and reload speed of those ammos are really bad. Now for our cheap version of the Snipe Cannon Pierce 3 Shield HBG build, we will go with 3 pieces of Safi and 2 pieces of Rajan. The gun has 4 Attack 5 Awakened skills and Pierce Capacity level 3. To reach 100% affinity, we have Weakness Exploit level 3, the Safi bonus which gives 20% affinity, 15% coming from the gun with an affinity augment, and Maximum Might level 2 to give us 20% more. When Maximum Might is active, you get a total of 105% on a tenderized weak spot. Now for damage, we're going to use Resentment 5 and a health augment for survivability. Please do note that this is a set with only guard 3. For the expensive set, you'll be able to place attack boost plus 5, which gives you an additional 5% affinity on top of that damage. And here, we've decreased the level of maximum might from level 2 to level 1, so you're exactly at 100% affinity on tenderized areas. Now, if you don't have the snipe cannon, or maybe you're out of Dracolites and you are already sick of Safi Jiva, here's the Kadachi Pierce 3 HBG mixed with the Safi set. It's the same as the cheap set of the Safi one, you still get resentment level 5, and of course, don't forget about the health augment. Now, for the expensive version of the build, like the snipe cannon set, would give you space for attack boost. But since the Kadachi only has one level 1 slot, you just get to fit attack boost level 4. Let's take a look at the damage numbers. This is without any buffs at all. The expensive version of the snipe cannon has 43 as its highest tick damage. On the other hand, the Kadachi has 42 as its highest tick damage, so there's not much of a difference really. So yeah, at the current state of the game, the Kadachi and Snipe Cannon are just really near each other, but maybe when Rarity 12 have access to more augment slots, it would be a game changer. But still, it's damn hard to let go of Kadachi because it has no deviation at all, as compared to the other gun. Hope the video helps, if it did, please do leave a like, I'm planning to do another Safi build video just before Safi ends, so subscribe. Check me out on Twitch as well, I do open lobby sessions and we have a growing community, newcomers are always welcome. See you in the next video guys.